What is up YouTube? Welcome back to another Dart Frog Adventures adventure. Tonight we are out at a haunted Frisbee Disc Golf Course. <laughs> so we had to take a quick break. We're losing all of our batteries and stuff as soon as we got over here to the little power plant thing. Um, so we just got back from getting some new batteries and went all, all of our batteries were dying. Uh, Jimmy's back there with the spirit box right now. We're out here at the haunted golf course or Frisbee golf course. Well, I guess it's a disc course. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and go on the adventure. So here's Haunted Huts. We're back at the Haunted Huts. We gotta go up and around that way to get to the waterfall. But there's a little bit of a bridge over this way too. I'll show you the bridge here in a second. Well, it's not really a bridge. It's like a little walk path. This is new from the last time that Marnie and I were out here. There it is right there. So yeah, by the way, uh, like I said, I don't know if I introduced everybody, but I haven't really got a chance to get the channel or the video started tonight. So I'm out here with my cousin Marnay. So Marnay is there and Yumi's there. And we're at the haunted golf frisbee course. <laughs> frisbee golf. Course. Frisbee golf course. It just sounds like, an, like a, a crazy way to say it. Just cool. Yeah. Do you hear that? Already? Uh huh. Uh, oh no! Yeah. All right. Let's start working our way towards the. So if you're wondering what that sound is, Yumi has a. Uh, he's using a spirit box. Uh. Morning, bro. It's the middle of the night. <laughs> well, it's morning somewhere. <laughs> It is not. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. So the last time that we were heading this way uh, this evening when we were starting the video, we got over here by the old hydroelectric plant. I don't know. It's like a little facility for power supplies. And uh, <clears throat> so there's like a little bit of power equipment over there. All our flashlights and stuff were failing once we got over there. So they found something over at the hut. No, 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 no. You said hold still. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> the damn thing invited him in. <laughs> yeah, don't go in there. Did you, I walked it. Hi there. <laughs> I just walked up there and said hi. Come on in. Oh my god. Yeah. Don't <laughs> <freak you. laughs> There's that power plant. So yeah, there's that canal right there too. Yeah, that's how we used to get to the waterfall before this was all opened up. Oh really? Yeah. So the only way there was through that ravine of rock, but then they opened up this whole area. There is a little bit of a natural spring that runs through that creek too. It's an old trough. Is it an old trough? Old watering trough. Oh snap, that's crazy. Looks like a crypt almost. Yeah, that's weird. That'd explain a lot in this area. Maybe this was fur trappers. Well, yeah, this was. No, no that, that, that'd oh. be like ranchers because that's recent. Yeah. No, but this uh, canyon used to be fur trapping canyon back in oh, the yeah. late 1800s. That's why, well, you know the reason why they named Cash Valley Cash Valley. Why's that? Because all the settlers and the tra or fur traders would come here and store their cache of furs. Oh wow! Every time I get it, so they named it Cache Valley. Yeah. <clears throat> all right, let's go through the creepy woods over towards the waterfall. Okay. There's some. There's reflectors over there. Yeah. They look like red eyes. There's a natural spring that's right around that creek over there too, or in that old creek bed, morning. Yeah. I found that not too long ago. Yeah, there's always water running, I was wondering about that. One of the last times that Marnay and I came out here, uh, there's like something that flew past us right here in this area as we come down from the waterfall. 
I think it was an owl. Oh, that's what we think it was. Made no sound, so we're not sure. But we're heading over to the waterfall here in like shortly. Oh, tripped over that stick. Okay, this ravine takes us all the way back to the haunted hut back there. Yeah. Okay. Where it used this to. This is what we used to take up to the waterfall all the way from back there, though. Look at all this. Is that dust? Or are those bugs? See that on the camera? Mm hmm. Is that dust or is that bugs? It's not bugs. I hear the natural. What was that? I just caught something flying past camera. It looked like a little fairy. That natural. The spring mm -hmm. right there. Yeah, the natural springs right here. Yeah. What was that? Did you hear that? No. Uh -uh. You didn't hear that uh, sound? I heard something. There's an old culvert right there, too. Careful where you're walking. <laughs> Yeah, there it is. Huh. There's the old waterfall. They made it like so much more reachable. Yeah. What the hell? There's still all that like rebar and steel that's up yeah. there. So you gotta be yeah, careful going up to, there. Like, there was so narrow right through here. You had to like climb through trees just to get up to there. Yeah. yeah there's like a little platform up there now. You have to expect like you almost have to expect like cave drawings to be on the wall over there or something. Something. <laughs> there's something moving there as soon as I got close. Really? Okay. It was like all over the place, like small movement. Like almost as if there was mice going in the way. Oh, look at that. There's icicles. Yeah. That's cool. So this. that oh, it's, cool. it's like it made no sound until we got up here yeah but I don't know if you can see that but there's icicles in there I think there's something up there. Probably an animal watching us. We should probably go. Next yeah, is some dirt just fell down off there. So as we're over here by the waterfall, some dirt was just falling down off the side of it. So we're gonna move our way down in case that decides to come down. Yeah, this place is draining my batteries tonight. So it's I'm crazy. <laughs> that thing was trippy. Did you hear that? Yeah. Something just popped right behind us. It's like something stepped on that stick, but there's nothing in there. <laughs> We're just kind of walking around, checking stuff out. <laughs> so as this place has been opened up, uh, I'm not exactly sure anymore of like where really the hottest spots are at. Still over there by the old uh, haunted huts, and it still seems to be active. Um, but opening this place up can really move stuff to a different spot. So we're just kind of walking around, checking stuff out. We still got some more stuff to go on that side over there. Ah! Stepping on a stick. Did you step on something blind and sticky? What is that? It's an old uh, pump of some sort. Cool. <laughs> so you me up here on this uh, trail if you want to take a right. That'll take us out by the river. 
Oh, they have a wood chipper in there. <laughs> Got a wood chipper over there for the piles of wood back here. What is what? Is that a rock? Looks like a... Yeah, that's like a tarp. What the hell is this wood chipper? Yeah, but why is the wood chipper popping right yeah. now? That's, like, that's what I said, it's a bad scenario on Halloween now. So as we're walking past the wood chipper, the wood chipper just popped. I don't know if I caught it on camera or not, but uh, it just popped. Throw it up for sure. <laughs> Innova disc golf. Yeah. Wonder how long these things are gonna be out here. I mean, I don't I think anybody really making it a permanent course though. I think so. I don't think anybody's really been out here using them yet. No, it looks like they're still working on building the courses up. I think so. Because they're gonna add in like signs that'll say like which tee and which right, which tee's number one, yeah, and two, how many shots seven. you got to get to it or something. Yeah. Difficulty with what? Yeah, I think that that's a planet. I think that's Venus. Yeah, it looks like that might be a planet. Venus it's either yeah. Venus or Mars. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's a planet. There should be a planet oh, out uh, there. When we're out of this canyon, I'll tell you guys the story of the UFO that me and my brother saw. Oh, yeah. Martin and I saw one too. Really? Yeah, we saw one when we were up camping. Yeah. We come back from Salt Lake one night, okay? Mm -hmm. There's something over there. Huh. A little bit. Yeah, this place is starting to come to life now. Big big ball right above right above the mountains above Bountiful. Hmm. And it wasn't moving. My brother's like, check that out. We're like, wow. I'm like, wow, that's that's cool. This was like at two o'clock in the morning. Okay. Come up, come through the canyon, and we notice it's out above Paradise. Same ball, and everything, and it just felt slowly faded out. Whoa. And we're coming around by the dam, and we noticed it was right above Hardware Canyon. We noticed it again, and I we I, we filmed it. It's on my my brother's phone. I used his phone, so they have mine. We filmed it, and watched it, and it faded out right above the canyon again. And this, like I said, it was about two thirty in the morning. Oh wow. oh wow. Well the one we saw we were up camping up left hand port mm -hmm. and it was like there was a it looked like a satellite but it was moving too fast uh -huh. and then it dropped and then zipped off. Really? Yeah it was yeah. like whoa what the that was weird. Because it didn't hold the path of a satellite that's for sure. No because satellites they and it was too low up, for slower, yower, yeah it was way too yeah. slow. And way too slow and low. A straight line. This thing was zipping across the sky, dropped down vertically and then took off the ground. Yeah. All right, what do you guys think? You want to start wrapping it up? Yeah. Sure. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and start wrapping up this video for tonight. This has been our Halloween adventure out here at the Haunted Golf uh, Tee Course. Golf Disc Five. Course. <laughs> and, uh, frisbee Golf. Frisbee Golf. Yes, Frisbee Golf. Is it, well, Frisbee Disc or disc of course <laughs> yeah so we're out here tonight at Halloween and we heard some crazy stuff I um, don't know what we caught on the video uh, so I hang on his phone just came back on your phone just like, came back on it's not dead anymore the guy was right here and he like noticed my watch went don't do that's when it connects to my phone oh wow 84% let's see well it drained it quite a bit yeah but it wouldn't come on. We're back over there by the haunted huts. 
using uh, Yumi's phone for a spirit box, it just completely shut off on us. It just drained the whole entire phone, went dead. Now it's back to 75%, and we're pretty much just left the golf course area. What the? This place is trippy. I just caught some red lights on my camera behind me. Yeah, and there's nothing back there. So, but uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and start wrapping up this video. Uh, it's been Marnie, Amy, J Frog, Dark Frog Adventures. If you're new to my channel, hit subscribe. If you like this video, hit like. Till the next adventure.